Okay, NAM 2011, we're here at the Nord booth with uh, Chris from Nord, and he's going to be kind enough to show us one of their new offerings, uh, the Nord Stage 2. So Chris, tell us a little bit about this uh, new keyboard. The Nord Stage 2 is a uh, evolution in the line of Nord. They have developed over the years technologies in synthesis, virtual analog modeling, uh, tone wheel organ modeling. They've brought sampling into their farm of technologies. Certainly a lot of the synthesis technologies they have are very uh, far advanced. So they brought into the stage two their best organ models taken from their top of the line C2 dual manual organ. They've also brought in their great uh, grand piano from their stage piano, which now features a whopping 500 megabytes of memory. You can download any of the pianos from the piano library available to use as free on the, on the Nord site, Nord.com. They have uh, modeled now sympathetic string resonance, pedal noise, and release samples. And then they have brought in a single oscillator version of the popular Nord Wave, a very powerful instrument that does FM synthesis, analog modeling, and you can also download samples from their library, an additional 380 megs of sample memory. So we'll listen to some of the sounds and go through. The instrument's designed to be split into three places. They have LEDs that indicate where the split points are, so you can decide if you want to change the split points. And the user will know in a dark stage where the split occurs. Very helpful. And they have a one panel concept, so you can have the organ, any kind of a piano, electric piano, clavinet, electric grand, and a synthesizer, all layered or split. And then you can take another panel with a different organ setting, a different piano, a different synth, and layer them or have up to six splits. So really live, all of the controls are labeled. There's not a lot of deep menus to look through. It all operates very quickly in real time. So we'll listen to the piano. This is the new Bosendorfer Imperial. If I demonstrate the sympathetic string resonance, I'll make sure any reverb is off. I'll hold some notes so I don't make sound while I'm pressing them, and then strike notes that relate harmonically. And we can hear ringing. If I play notes that don't relate and harmonic, we don't hear any ringing. This makes a big difference when you're playing large chords, because you're hearing resonation from other relative notes. Um, when we hear pedal noise, if I step very lightly on the sustain pedal, it's very subtle. We'll hear it in headphones. As I step harder, we're going to hear the dampers lift up, the knocking kind of sound, and the resonation of the uh, of the resonance of the entire piano enclosure. The releases are there so that as I let off, and again in a good headphone or a good listening environment, we'll hear the dampers come down and stop the strings. So they've gone to a great length to model the piano. Uh, there's 60 voices for the piano section. Again, up to 500 megabytes of memory that you can load their pianos into. Uh, they have a new, a new uh, Steinway piano. You can hear that sympathetic ring. Then they have uh, six different uh, Tyne electric piano sounds. They actually have names in the display that'll bright Tyne, sparkle top, that define the actual instruments they recorded. There's a reed electric piano. Again, all the classic effects you would want. So on this reed electric piano, it's labeled Wurlitzer in there, so I suppose I can mention the name. I'll put a tremolo on it, which is classically found on the Wurlitzer. And then we get... A 
I can put it through an app simulation, which they offer. So I can say I want to put it in an app. It'll be a little bit thinner. Put a little drive, so a little bit of distortion, and I get. Little amp. The clavinets have all the four rocker positions represented, A, B, C, and D, and they're all great. So you get a. And then these switches change the pickup positions so you can get a big break. The really great clavinet stuff. This section is the uh, biggest improvement, biggest change, the synth section. So we can listen to some of the library that I downloaded earlier and put in the machine from the Mellotron. The whole concept of the front panel is it's all live, so I can use the filter, add some resonance. some release a long attack there's a huge library of sounds uh, you can go on the Nord site and find all of the Mellotron and the Chamberlain sounds there's a ton of them now, does so, it have a, an interface for the uh, computer if you want to? Yes, they have, a, they have a librarian where you can drag your patches around and organize them. They have a sample editing program where you can bring your own WAV files in, make key maps, make programs, and then dump them in over USB. The USB connection also sends MIDI out over USB, so you can use it as a controller also. The last thing I didn't show really is the organ section. This now they've taken from the C2. I'll add a little bit of uh, overdrive here and go for a classic prog rock type of organ sound. And I can dry that up and turn it into a very pretty kind of organ sound. Very, very nice, everything live. I, I love the fact that you can now combine it so I could say I want the piano with that. I can add the strings in and if I want to control the gain of the strings, I can use the morphing technology so I could say I want the volume off on the strings. When I bring up the wheel, I want that to control the volume. So now this is going to be controlling this knob. So as I'm playing... And that's just one panel. I can layer two panels. Very flexible very fast instrument. It'll be in the United States sometime in the uh, end of March. They'll ship from Sweden uh, in February. The uh, MAP right now for the 88 note is $41.99. There's a 76 note, fully weighted action, and then there's also a 73 note with a waterfall key, similar to found on the organ or the Nord Electro that has a semi-weight. A lot of guys that like to do a lot of sliding on the organ like that action. 73 notes fits in almost virtually any car, too. So that's the newest uh, product from Nord, and I thank you for your time. Thank you very much.